You want me to talk? Okay. I decided to make this challenge in drag. Uh, which is to say, I never wear a dress. Or at least, I wear one about, well this one, maybe once every five years. It's not because I'm not comfortable in it, because I am, I love this dress, but it's the shoes that are the problem. Anymore. Just can't wear them anymore Wait for another day. Just because I put these shoes on my feet and decided to make this awkward challenge. <laughs> It's possible to assume that nature isn't awkward, but that is not, is not the case. The wisteria is a profoundly awkward plant. In fact, I love its flowers. They're tremendously delicate. They have a cloying scent, but I cannot bear the plant itself. It's a parasite. It takes over. It chokes things. Look at the ungainly, unwieldy nature of this plant. It's living in the pear tree. It sends runners out that go about 10 feet long within a few seconds of a day goes underground and takes over other things. I've also wondered if the psyche works in similar ways in its pathways. And if it does, it's a friggin' scary prospect. So I've done a lot of thinking and writing about all of this. And I'm interested to know, <laughs> I'm gonna fall off these shoes. I'm interested to know where awkwardness will take you if you follow it. Where does it take you? It knows no balance. It just knows where it wants to go and makes its way. Look what it's done here. Extraordinary. If you let it into a room with you, if you stole it or define it, if you conjure it or are it, I could say enjoy your awkwardness, but I don't want to produce slogans, so. I won't. Submit your video. Submit your video. Submit your video. Submit your video in the name of awkwardness. And the video judged to be the most compellingly awkward by an awkward panel of judges will receive a free t-shirt. Free t-shirt, an awkward t-shirt, and a copy of awkward a detour. A copy of awkward a detour.